So while we're talking about Rudd, I see he was up to his usual populist tricks on the weekend, appearing on the Rove program. Yeah, yeah. Yes, well, it's, uh, it's something of a tradition now, isn't it? Mm. So I think at the last election, Mark Latham went on Rove, uh, not as a guest. He was just there to pioneer the segment. Latham loses it. Now taken over by Husey, but uh, look, no, I thought uh, I thought Rudd did pretty well yeah, on Rove on the whole. Well, not without a lot of help, thank you very much. Yeah. I mean, he didn't just cruise through that interview all on his own, you know. God, no, no, no. He had, he had a little earpiece inside his ear the whole time, really? and he was taking detailed instructions from yours truly. You make up your mind whether you want that or not. All and, right, Kevin. Uh, um, he's, he's probably going to ask about the earwax soon, so you've got to pretend you have a sense of humour about it. All right. If you can't actually laugh, I just want you to open your mouth and pretend to laugh. It works. So, does it worry you when shows like us make jokes about people like you going, "Whoa, here's that old earwax footage again"? Right. Open it. Open it now. Good. Hold it. Hold it wider. Wider. No, yes, no, pointing doesn't work. Put it, put it down. Uh, now, you remember, you find this very funny. Open your mouth. OK, that's long enough. That's long enough. No, no, you look like a dick. Kevin Rudd, Leader of the Opposition and possible future Prime Minister, who would you turn gay for? Oh, God, I didn't know that they'd find out you were gay. Um, just get out of there. Get, get, get the fuck out of there, you gay fool. Quickly. Actually, no, it would look bad. Sit down. Um, oh, remember that comedy script we wrote? Uh, the comedy script. Pull it out. OK, yes. Thank God we thought of the funniest person you could turn gay for. First one we had was Dame Edna. That's funny. Um, oh, God, the audience didn't laugh. Outrageously they mustn't have heard of Dame Edna. Just keep going. The country wasn't ready for a Prime Minister no, you're worse than David Brent. So. Kevin Rudd, here we go. Who is it, though? Who have you chosen? Who would you turn gay for? Don't say John Howard. There's only one person for me. Don't say Howard. It's my wife, Therese. Yes! Yes, oh. you fooled him into thinking you're straight. Is she a man? <laughs> right, that was a joke, so open your mouth. Oh, God, you're a loser. You can be a stubborn bastard to advise sometimes. Oh, I bet,